welcome back to our table. This is Mickey. And this is JJ. And today we are starting a very fun series. We think. Yes. We hope. Well, I, for me it's going to be fun. Today, well, let's see. The day this is being uploaded I'm just a mushroom. is May 13th, 2019. 100 years and two days ago on May 11th, 1919, the first Hostess chocolate cupcakes were sold. So Hostess this year is celebrating their 100th birthday, 100th anniversary. Mm -hmm. And we are big fans, or I'm a huge fan, of all things Hostess snack cakes. So I wanted to do a little tribute. And what better way to do that than pick up a whole bunch of different Hostess snacks and talk about them and review them and tell a little bit of history and enjoy some great Hostess cakes with JJ here. And we're going to start with the very first one today. Hey, but before we do, though, like I said, it's a five-part series, so check back every day from when five you first watch this. But maybe you're watching it two weeks later and all five are available. <laughs> but if you watch them as we go every day. I don't know what's wrong with my voice. So today, Hostess Chocolate Cupcakes. Does it get any more classic I don't know. than a I've cupcake? I've never had one. You've never had a Hostess chocolate cake? I've never had well, a Hostess. Well, then this is a special treat. I've only had one Twinkie. I've never had a Ding Dong. Okay, well, we're going we're gonna to hit this all this. This year is the first time I've But anyway, first, first before we try it, though, while I'm opening up here. I don't know. The Hostess cupcake was the first commercially produced cupcake. <laughs> Matter of fact, <clears throat> it's the first commercially produced snack cake, period. I mean, this started it all. Your Little Debbie's, your Tasty Cakes, your Inamans. Hostess, th this started it all. This goes all the way back and you just wash your hands. Yeah, I did. You can't do anything. I don't remember what I paid for this pack, but you know when these things come out, you used to be able to get two of them for a nickel. Yeah, I know. Right? Don't you wish you could still do that? Not even a quarter? Nope. Two for a nickel. Way back in the day. Hostess chocolate cupcakes. Man, these things are soft. I'm going to have a prepper because I'm not... Ready for sweet. Oh, hurry up. Get that back out of the shot. This is about the cake, not about the you take a drink between videos. Anyway, hostess cupcake. They're soft, they're delicate. I'm gonna give it a little squeeze here so you can see how spongy the cake oh, is. It's a chocolate sponge cake. There's icing on the bottom and I'm mm -hmm. like that. Mine's you ready? Not special, but... This is her first hostess cupcake. This is this is actually quite exciting. This is probably my four thousandth hostess cupcake. I've asked my mom being, to buy them being so many times. It never happened. Whatever. Okay. What, do you know what's inside? Cream? Yes. Yes. Oh, cream. Cream That's extremely sweet. Oh my gosh. Okay. Mm. You feel how soft and spongy that is? And the icing is a firm icing. That's real. Yes, it has cream in the middle. But. What's wrong? You get it all over you? Go mm ahead. -hmm. But. They didn't start with the cream in the middle. That was 1950. They started putting cream and the squiggly lines on top. Before that, it was just a chocolate cupcake with icing. Oh, and you know, we went out to eat last, what, Saturday? And yeah. uh, went to a place. She was going to get a milkshake. She seen they had malted. They had chocolate malt. I love malt. You know, in the early days, you could get a chocolate malted version of icing of these? Mm, it. I say it or not. Mm. No, that just sounded so good. This is the cake, huh? The malt thing sounded oh, yeah. so good. Aww. And then later years they had orange. The orange ones are really good still, too. Mm. I don't like orange. Hostess went through some changes through the years. Started out in 1919 as the Continental Baking Company. All the way up until 1995 when it was acquired by the Interstate Baking Corporation. Are you okay? I think became so. hostess brands in 2009. Unfortunately, they had to start liquidating their assets back in 2012 ish, maybe, because of a strike with the workers' union. Oh. In 2013, the hostess brands were sold to some private investors and they brought back these classic, iconic cakes. So the world became I'm right again. Hmm? I said, I'm going to Didn't they? Don't they have like baseball ones and mm -hmm. stuff? They do special versions of the cut where they have in the past the baseball versions with the red squiggly lines on a white cupcake. It's really good. Mm -hmm. You know that they can make 11,000 cupcakes an hour with their conveyor ovens. I wish I worked in quality control at Hostess going around tasting cakes. Being like, yep, yep, that's good, that's good, that's still good, that's still good. 
But anyway. I have a baseball. So we got our little rating system here. We're going to do it right quick. That's an awesome JJ, fun. Hostess Cupcakes. What do you give them? First time trying them. So two thumbs up. Always two thumbs up for me. I don't like sweets, as I've stated multiple times. I, I think I've stated the reason, too. Um, go find that somewhere. But with water, it was okay. <laughs> well, it's not I tell you, they're sweet. best with a glass of ice cold milk, whole milk too. None of that skim, watered down, two percent, one percent. I don't whole even like milk. milk though. Well, but they're better with milk. I'm Everything's not, better with I'm milk. I'm not American. I don't like milk. I don't like. You sports. are American. You're American through and through. Uh, but I tell you what, folks, if you've never had a Hostess cupcakes, it's hard to imagine. But I was shocked that even my own daughter never had a Hostess cupcake. So there are people out there who's not. You should have seen this face whenever I told him I have never had a. Yeah, well, we're going, we'll tell that story later. We'll tell that story later. We're going to do snowballs too, so we'll tell oh, that yeah. later. Oh, yeah, they're coming up in a few days. Um, so, you didn't make me lose my point. You're welcome. Oh, I know what I was going to say. It was something. Uh, we're doing this series to honor and celebrate Hostess 100 years. We congratulate them through all their trials and tribulations. That Hostess is still a nationally known brand. And I'm going to tell you what's cool about this. Mm -hmm. When you, the fact that we still have Hostess cupcakes after 100 years to share them. Stuff has been shared from father to son, mother to daughter, huh? father to daughter, co-workers set and eat them together, friends set and eat them together, babysitters and the kids are watching eat them together. Hostess cupcakes tie so much of our country together. You don't think about it, but it does because uh, the man who walked on the moon, Elvis Presley, the man who stormed the beaches at Normandy in World War II, uh, so many generations over the last hundred years have all partaken in Hostess chocolate cupcakes, and we're still able to do that today, and I'm very thankful for it. So, congratulations, Hostess. Uh, I hope we have a hundred more years. I hope these are still around for you to share with your kids, and for them to share with their kids. <laughs> my kids. Well, okay, just to pretend you were going dog. to have kids. Yeah, share them with you. Well, no, chocolate's bad for dogs. Uh, do you know what Skyler did? I know what Skyler did, but chocolate is bad for dogs. Shit. Anyway, that, we're not going to tell that story here. All right, because we got to go. See see how much time we've already taken. But congratulations, hostess. Seven Happy minutes. birthday. We hope you enjoy this video. We hope our people watch enjoy the video. Like, subscribe. Subscribe so you don't miss the rest of the host videos. And leave us a comment. I want to hear your story of hostess cut. Please quit playing with your hair during our food videos. That's disgusting. Uh, share your story of hostess cupcakes down below and until next time she's jj he's mickey hey coming up next but i'm gonna give you a little trivia question while you're waiting on the next video whether it's tomorrow or you're just waiting on it to load up and don't you answer this because you probably know what was the second big dog hostess cake to hit the market we're gonna do it next we're doing them all in order but when they come out so watch for that tomorrow but she's mickey or nope she's jj he's mickey we already said this yeah we'll see you next time bye right, bye